Chris. Welcome back to my channel. Oh man, I feel I have not done a video in a really long time. Um, if you're wondering what I'm wearing, it's an elf costume. Yes, it is. We had a work meeting where we had to wear Christmas pajamas. So I do have an elf costume, booties and all. Yeah. Um, so I'm going to be doing my Ipsy unbagging and this is going to be my last one guys. I know I say this and everyone's like, yeah, right, Chris, you say it all the time and I do say it all the time and then I say, you know what, $10, whatever, but they're just getting so horrible. I can't stand it anymore. I just can't. I, I'm just so done. Um, Okay, so the first thing I got, it's like, we're, life is short, wear glitter. I was all excited. I was expecting this to be a glitter bag, amazingness. I got none of that. So, um, really upset. So what came outside the box is a product, actually a product from a company that I really love. Um, very high end and very surprised that, um, that Ipsy put it in here, but it is a Bye Bye Under Eye by It Cosmetics, and it's an anti-aging full coverage waterproof concealer, which is wonderful, except it's in the shade Neutral Medium, and that is so not me. So I will not use this. I will pass it on. Um, there's light, then there's neutral medium, then there's tan, and there's deep. Actually, I might keep it in my kit just for, you know, use on other people, but yeah, it's not something that I will use. Um, then I got this CRX Birch, Birch Sap Moisturizing Lotion. Um, it doesn't tell me if it's for the face or not, but it's just a little teeny tube. Um, I like how they're putting these in baggies, I guess, to be a little, you know, so nothing leaks out, even though everything should have a safety seal on it. I don't know, um, but okay, so a moisturizer, and um, I got a Oil of Morocco Argan Oil Sulfate Free Volume Shine Hairspray. I actually used some of this today. This is pretty decent. I like it, um, and this brand is not really that expensive. I have their shampoo and their conditioner, so you know... Would I use it? I mean, yeah, of course I'll use it, but I mean, I can also, I mean, to me, hairspray is hairspray, you know, I mean, I don't know. This is by Mark Anthony. I don't know. I'm just not loving this. And then the last thing is a J Cats um, Wonder Lip Paint, and this is in the color, no, I think I got one more thing. This is in the color, what is this in the color of? I don't know. But it's a very, oh, Mad Splatter. I have one other of these and I want to say it's the same color, but it's a very sort of um, magenta looking color. Very nice. I mean, it's definitely my color. I don't know how I feel about these um, lip paints. Um, post down below, guys. Let me know what you think. If you love the lip paints, if you don't. I find them to be very, I know you only need a little bit, but I find them to be very smeary. And I just, I can't deal with smeary stuff on my lips. Um, the last thing that I got was this gem pencil from Star Looks which is an ultra olive, and it looks like it's a glittery olive color. Um, depending on the consistency, I may use this, I may not. But in general, oh, and here's the bag. This is my glitter, guys, right here. This is my glitter, is the bag. I mean, I would love to have gotten glitter products. I just, and I saw some of the glam bags and they were really cool like glitter nail polishes and stuff like that and I got nothing to that effect and I'm just done so I will definitely be canceling this post down below let me know what you got in your ipsy um if you loved it if you hated it I hated it I mean especially when I see girl meets glitter I'm expecting all stuff glitter and I got nothing so Nothing glitter but the bag. So, yep, two thumbs down. Um, and that will be the last Ipsy unboxing I believe you will see from me unless they send me one next month. And I forget if they go a month in advance. But anyway, that's it. Done. I'll talk to you guys later.
Love you. Don't forget to clicky, clicky, and subscribe.